Hey, what is up guys? It is me, Zayden, and welcome back to another video on the channel. And today, guys, we are going to be building Green's Hermitcraft Season 6 base. And, um, Construction Bob, again, has been working on the Hobbit Hole. He's built this bit, so you get a nice view. Kind of see Green's base. And I think he's been working up step. Bob! Looks like he's been doing some demolition. He's blown a hole right in the cliff. Anyway, um, so today we're going to be starting off by giving a shout out to somebody who is building green space alongside me. And today the person who's getting a shout out is called Tim Koken. And he's building this in survival, which is crazy. And is making the flat floor on top end of episode 12 which is you need a lot of concrete for that but um so yeah that's really good and he's also a great supporter of the channel so thank you very much so um today we're going to hopefully be kind of finishing off this layer just so we can set up the next layer really and um for the final layer i have uh, double checked so we um without further ado i guess that we should just begin construction so we want to start as we've kind of done on the previous layers by putting these quartz slabs so everything should be kind of familiar at this point so you just kind of go around on the top layer of the top half of the block so you should be able to walk on it like this not like this if that makes sense so, and it should be even with that, but you don't want to um, place a half slab, a half slab, a slab in front of the cyan terracotta. Um, so you just kind of put it right in front of every glass bit, and I will show you what to do here because here is a little bit, might be a tiny bit confusing. So here, all you want to do is place a slab here and two here. So it's kind of what you think you do but um just good to always check so you've got two slabs here one there so then you go one one you don't connect them up at the corners like this you just do completely diagonal you go around and then again you put two here and then one here and three three four four three three one and then two so just remember you don't put it like in front of these like this because that would just be a bit confusing so then you go one 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 whoops one <laughs> i cannot place slabs apparently and then two and then one here three three four no slab in front of that one four three three one then two and then one one so just like that i'll just kind of show you so you can pause the video and see that so you know what to do there and i think we'll just go all the way around because this clearly is not taking very long luckily so we just go like this and three three four four three three one two i can see over there can you see that that's annoying me um one 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 two one three three very good so I'm just going to fix this annoying bit of glass and then we're going to want to everywhere with a slab you're going to want to place white concrete on top of it. So that's easy just go around like this place it there and there just not on top of this sand terracotta it might look a bit confusing but you'll see what happens. So yeah just go all the way around place a bit of white concrete on top of every single slab you see and once you're done should look there like we go that's looking pretty good and um so now that we've done that it kind of looks a bit more topped off now so it doesn't just look like random glass there and so now this this white concrete isn't actually going to be seen but it makes it much easier to place it here so we want to place one white concrete right in front of that so it goes like that and that so you'll see it on previous layers again so you can just kind of compare to that and if you're a bit stuck on any, you can even just improvise with, and because you kind of know the pattern from other layers, so you can just use that. But, um, so, you just want to, and you can tell what's going to happen, really. So you just want to go 
like this and then place it in front of these three. So you've got this and ooh, that should be there. So once you get to this one, you place it in front of there. And then here you place two concrete and one of them should be right on top of this tower. So kind of like this. So you should be able to see that and copy that. So then you go just one, 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 one. So it just looks like it's connected diagonally, really. And um, so then you want to go uh, so one, two again for this. And then one, one, two, three. And then just place it along the front of this. Three, three. And then we do one and then two and then one, one, one. Turn the other way, one, 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 one. So once you get to the middle of this, you, sh you might as well just turn the other way because it makes it a lot easier because rather than doing this like this, you get to do it the proper way. So like this and then three, and three. So yeah, just go all the way around and complete that. And then once you're done, you should have There we this. go, that looks good. So you've got two blocks coming out. So it's just like slabs and then blocks. And then if you can see the previous layers, I mean, you can pretty much guess what's going to happen. Oh, look, we place another slab. And then we can build the bit of cyan terracotta that goes around. But anyway, so we basically want to go. So let's take the front of the base and then we're just going to, like this one, we want to go the second half of the block. So when it goes up, it should kind of go up in like slabs. So it's like half a slab and then half a slab there, if you see that. So if you were, you'd be able to walk up it without jumping if it was the other way around, if that makes sense. So you got your one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Um, so it should be nine, uh, by the way, because there's four on this side, four on this side, one. That makes nine. So, um, so then we go one, two, three here. One, two, three. And then it's pretty self-explanatory. You just go one, then one, two, one, one, one. You don't connect them like this, like the other layer that we did. And then just, oh, whoops. Make sure you place them right. Uh, then just go around, place them in front of every single white concrete. And remember, once you get to these bits, uh, turn. So you should, so if you're placing them like this, you should probably turn because it makes it easier. And you can, because otherwise you're placing it in front of the blocks like this, and obviously it's not complete. So you just go like this. And um, just to show you for this bit, it's pretty simple. You just do that, if you can see that. And, um, no, was that the bit that, yeah, yeah, that was. So then you go around. You might as well just do this in the video, because the slabs are always quite quick to do. Uh, so just place them in front of these like this. Turn the other way again. One, two, three, and then place them in front of this. And then go three, and then one. Then we've got this. So then we go one, 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 one. Just all the way around. And um, there was something I wanted to say. So, um, because obviously this is the last layer, this should only take a couple of episodes to um, finish off. I mean, yeah, I, th I think maybe two episodes after this to finish off. So, I think, and then after that, to do the rest of the base, I mean, I think we are more than halfway through the base for the record. Um, but to do the rest of the base, these towers here will probably take maybe four episodes to do, and the other towers and the stripes and everything, so... Yeah, and then the rings might take two, three episodes to do, so that's seven episodes. Then interior, maybe three episodes? So that's like 12 episodes left. That's like 27 episodes, right? Because we're on episode 15, so that's pretty good. I mean, that's like... That's quite soon. Anyway, so that's pretty exciting. But for now, we must continue with the other things so again like you did over here you just want to place white concrete on every single slab that you see um so just put it everywhere and just do that all the way around so on every single slab that you see here that's exposed just place white concrete on it so it will look like this once you're done but um so just do that all the way around 
And then you should have Right, this. that's looking good. Um, and by the way, for the actual towel, this bit of the base, the main base, I'm not sure it could potentially take three episodes. It's hard to estimate, but um, actually the glass bit will probably be a qu bit quicker because there's literally only the front faces because it's so small. But um, yeah, so now we want to do, like we've done on many other layers, to be honest, you can probably do this by yourself, but I just want to make sure that you guys understand. So if not, then you can just skip this episode if you really want to. But um, I think that um, I want you guys to make sure that your base is right. So you want to go diagonal and one back and you can place a cyan terracotta down here. It won't make a difference. If it makes it easier for you, you can go like this one and then two because it wants to be two blocks high. So like one, two. But I prefer to just do it diagonally because it takes up less time. So it goes like one, two, <clears throat> and then goes one, two, one, two, three, and then one, two, one. So just kind of like go around like this, placing the sand terracotta and build it two up. So you're just going to have these ones. And I mean, you can go like this, I guess, but I mean, it's... Just, just, I prefer just making it so it looks right rather than having any extra bits. So you just go like this and then, if I can break the right block, and then we go like this and then just keep going around placing it one back and so I'll just kind of show you what it will look like. So just like this and then do that all the way around and then once you're done, you should have this right there we go so this is two blocks high and it goes all the way around like this so just kind of skim around so you can see and that is looking really good so now we kind of have uh this but it looks a little incomplete so now we want to you get our slabs out again but um we want to do so we want to place it on the second half of that block so it should be I think it's the same as this layer because this is one and a half block high. So this layer is the exact same. It's one and a half blocks high because the slabs are on the second half of the block and it should be even walking across here to here. So it's on the second half of the block. And then you go just around placing slabs on every single bit. And of course, remember to face the other way when you're... Remember to face the way that you are building. So like this when you're making the slabs. And um, you just place it in front of every single bit. And this bit looks diagonal like this. And yes, yeah, so none of the diagonals should connect, of course, as we mention always. So you just go all the way around and basically do this. And I'll probably keep this in the video. The slab bits are always to be kept in the video. So um, uh, yeah. And to be honest, I might just aim to do... The rest of this base in two episodes and just have a bit of a longer episode if it takes too long or two longer episodes i'm not sure we'll just see how it goes just as long as i can produce the video by sunday i will be happy so right we are i think we're nearly all the way around so that's good right just a few more slabs to place in in front and there we go that's awesome so, right, so you've got this. Still looks a little incomplete because, well, it is, to be honest. Um, so we just need to place a bit of white concrete on top of all of these slabs. And um, so I know this is a bit repetitive, so it should literally be in the exact same place as this other white concrete that we've already placed. Um, so that's good. So just place it all the way around. And then, once you're done, you should have something that looks a little bit like There we this. go. That's looking pretty good. So we've got um, this. So now, we want to connect these up at the corners. So at the moment, it, they're just connected by diagonals. If you want to go one into the cyan terracotta, so you go one here, and then you go one. So just place it on the cyan terracotta, and for the one, you just cover the whole bit of cyan terracotta. You might remember this from the previous layer. So here you just, everywhere there's a cyan terracotta, you place white concrete. Then you place it on the cyan, and the cyan terracotta nearest the next section of the base, rather than, it wouldn't make sense if you put it there, obviously. You should be able to see kind of what to do. Just place it around like this, and um, then just um, place it where you think it should go. And then we're going to do 
a couple more of these and then we're going to have to do the um, boxes kind of thing we did here. Um, basically this, which hopefully wasn't too confusing because um, we're going to have to do it again, unfortunately. Um, so, right, we're here. So then we need to connect it up to here. So basically you just connect each section up by a block like this so you can, so you can basically walk across all of it without kind of going on the tiny bit that connects the two blocks if you know what I mean so and remember to connect it from the inside not like the outside so yeah just go all the way around placing it here and connecting these bits up and basically it should look you should be able to tell if it looks right so is there much point of me really cutting this out of the video I don't think so it's not going to add on that much time. Oh, oh, that's us done. Well, that, I didn't think that. Right, okay, so now we want to go up a layer and pretty much do the exact same thing. We just need to go up and then we need to go all the way around with this using blocks like this. So you don't want to go diagonal, you want to use these blocks. And you don't want to go like this. You want to make sure you can see these blocks that connect the... Line. So, so just basically mimic this layer and go all the way around just like this and yeah so just go like ones and just should be pretty obvious to tell where everything goes so just like this one two three four and then that goes like that so just do that do it all the way around once you're done you right that is looking good so we're kind of building it up so that's um so we've um, got, so we're ready for the next layer. And um, so now we want to, I think, to be honest, we are running out of time a bit. So I think we'll just do the next layer and then end the episode here. So this layer is actually going to be the layer of two. But I think that we'll build the two in the next episode. So you basically just go around like this. And... Um, like this. Maybe we'll do it in this episode. We will see. Uh, so we want to basically go all the way around. Basically, literally just doing exactly what we've done for the for these bits. Just going all the way around. And remember to keep the blocks that connect each bit of white concrete together. And um, just go around and do that all the way around. So once you're done, you should have this. There we go, and basically, unfortunately, we're running out of time at the moment, but in the next episode, we will do these little um, uh, square things. I'll just break this for now so we can go off to a fresh start. But if you remember from last time, you can go ahead, and I'll try not to go too long on that, and then we'll be able to build the base for the next layer, start building the next layer, and that will be all good. So, unfortunately, that's all we've got time for today, but thank you so much for watching this video, and remember to like and subscribe if, you, if you're new to the channel. I upload these videos every Sunday, and so, yeah, guys, I will see you guys later. Bye!